In this video, we will see the most common types of constants and variables used in any expert advisor. More specifically, we will review the main functions of the most common simple ones. If we visit this documentation page on the mql4.com site, we will find the six types of simple variables available in the MQL4 or 5 programming language. You can find the link on the description. All constants and variables in our EA can be of any type. The ones we will focus on this video are string, integer, double, and boolean. Those of daytime and color type can be created in our EA by using blocks in the builder, so we will skip them now. The rest are far less common, so we will not study them. Now, let's see those four in more detail. String type variables are used to define character strings. That means letters and symbols, not numbers. In FXDreamer, they will be especially useful when defining time periods. We will write the word string in the type field when creating it. Let's suppose we want our EA to work for a specific period of time every day. We can choose the initial and final time for that period by creating two string variables. The first one will be called initial time, and the second one final time. Then we will write the value for both of them. In our example, from 9 o'clock in the morning to 8.15 p.m. As we are using the standard time notation, we will write the two-point symbol. It is not a number, but a string of characters. This is why we need this type of variable. Integer type variables are used for numbers only, and more specifically, for positive or negative numbers without a fractional component. We will write the letters i and t in the type field when creating it. A variable of this type would be used for values such as 0, 1, 12 or minus 34, for example. No plus symbol is necessary when referring to positive numbers. Double variables are used for numbers only, too, but in this occasion including those positive and negative with a fractional component. We will write the word double in the type field when creating it. The possible values for this type of variable include those numbers available for integer variables and also any other one with an unlimited digits fraction. For example, 0, 22.34 or minus 67.891. Boolean variables are of a logic type. They are used to check if a condition is true or false. We will write the letters BOOL in the type field when creating it. In this case, there are only two possible values, true or false, so we will write the one required to initialize the variable when creating it. As we saw in our previous video, we can create as many constants and variables as required by our algorithm to be implemented. All of them need to be defined first by their type, as we have explained and then initialized with a value. Later in the course we will see several examples for all of them.